Ladies and gentlemen, hello, my name is Austin from AwfulMedia.com, and welcome back. We're going to continue the WordPress theme today. Um, off camera, I did a little bit of CSS styling, not very much. I added some margin around the heading tags, and um, this list here is a bit different. Just some border, and uh, that's about it. I can show you how I did the border. On the LI, I have a one pixel solid with a color. But the border, the border on the bottom is set to none, and then on the UL I have a border on the bottom of one pixel. We're doing that so that we don't have any overlapping border. If we had a border on the bottom of the LI, then a border on the top of the LI, they would stack, and you'd have like a two pixel border in between each list item, and we don't want that. Then I have the anchor tag block with a padding. So pretty much it. And this whole thing is a clickable link, All right? Okay, so that's that's that. But today I want to work on the single.php page, and that's going to be the page that brings in all of our page content, uh, the game, description, title. Whenever you click on a link, it'll take you to, well, yeah, this Alpha Media Games equals Adventure Game. And on this page, we'll see the game, the title, and all that stuff just for that one game. So to do that, what we're going to do is go here and take the index page. I'm going to copy and paste that. And I want to name it single.php, not .php, if you already have the PHP extension on the file you copied. But let's open this up in our text editor. And I want to get rid of this advertisement. Don't need that for this. Don't need the slider for this either. And we don't need the content that's already inside of this section. Okay. And we don't need this section. So we pretty much have nothing left but the template parts and the section. So now if we hit control S, let's, let's uh, add something here, uh, single, single, that's the same thing, all right? If we refresh here, we click on a game, adventure game. It'll take us to this page where we have single, <laughs> okay? So we know it's working. Now all we have to do is style it and bring in the content. So first of all, let's bring in the title. So if we refresh, click on racing game, you'll see racing game. Okay, now let's bring in the description. I'm just bringing stuff in. We're not styling it or anything yet. Field, and then description. That's a custom field. Control S. Lots of racing with a side of room. And now we want to bring in the content, but these games do not have content. If we go to the games and we go to edit a game, there's no content in here, right? This content will be the embed code or the flash file, whatever it is we're doing, but we have to grab something to use first. So let's just go ahead and go over to congregate.com, and I think they have a, yeah, games for your site. And they have all these cool games. I think this is games from the games that they sponsored in the past. We'll take one of these games. See, those are pretty wide games, which is why we're going with a full width. So I want to get rid of the advertisement. We'll have an ad below the game or something because you have to have an ad or you're just uh, you know sending out money and not getting any back. But we will take one of these embed codes real quick. Go to the content area and paste that in under the text tab. If we hit update, we go back. That was on adventure game. Now click adventure game. Nothing's there because we had to bring it in. So we go back here and we'll say PHP the content control S refresh. Oh, this needs to be within the loop. That was my bad. So if we go look at our index page, we will see the loop that we were using it was right here. We were using pretty much that. We're checking if they have posts and we're saying, okay, while we do have post, bring out the post, right? And we're going to end the loop right here. We're going to say PHP. We're going to end the while first, it looks like. And then we're going to end the if. So open up the loop, run the loop, make sure we have the title, the field, and the content of the loop. And then end the while and end the if. So end the while and then end the if. Hit Control S, go to the browser, refresh, and there is our game. So now let's style this a little bit. Um, Add a little bit of structure to this. I want to add a class of game container. 
And in the style sheet, I want to go down right here and add game container. And if we look at this, if we right click in here and go inspect element, you'll see that WordPress automatically adds a paragraph tag around the content. So we can kind of use that to work for us here. I want to say paragraph tag, and then we'll say text align center. If we refresh, see that I put the game in the center of the page as well as any content within that the content itself, which means this as well. So now we can um, add some mm, padding of like 10 pixels, add a margin to the top of, let's see, we'll add a margin of 20 pixels, zero. Okay, now let's go to the, just the game container. I'll set a background color of uh, 4044B. I do whatever you want, um, you know, just whatever. I'll go to the single.php and the title. I'll wrap that in an h1 tag because this should be the most important thing on this page. Venture game, same color as the background. So to fix that, we'll go to the style.css. Come down to game container. We'll say game container h1 color FFF. Refresh, adventure game. Now this isn't looking very good. I'm aware of that. I'm just doing it as I go and seeing what we get. Hmm. I'm thinking margin. Let's add a margin of 10 pixels. I can tell one thing I want to do is make the background a bit darker. So we have 4B, 4B, 4B. Let's make it a bit darker. We don't want it to match the navigation bar because that doesn't really do what we want it to do. So let's uh, give it a really dark, dark, dark gray. That looks a bit better, in my opinion. Hmm. Don't know exactly how we would do this. For the sake of this, we will remove this, because it just doesn't work in any kind of styling situation. So, I mean, if you're going to use this for any kind of website, actually, make sure you find their terms and, uh, you know, obey them. Okay, so the content is there, though. We just, I just have to, uh, I'm going to do some styling off-camera. And get it to where I want it to be. It's just uh, there's quite a bit to do, so I'll do that and then talk about it in the next one. But I I don't want to do all that on camera because it's going to be quite a bit. I'll do that too much in this one, I'm pretty sure. But um, next time this will look a bit better. Then we'll get into going down the page a bit. Maybe we'll work on the comments section because that's kind of an important section. Um, but yeah, so that's the single .php started. It's working fine. I want to test something. Let's go ahead and click on one of these and uh, embed code. And that should count views. Okay, so it didn't count the view. Wait, we, we got rid of that function, didn't we? Oh, we have to use the set post views. So we'll just take this, copy, put it within the loop, it'd be okay. I want to set this to set post views. Let's see, one views. Refresh. Click on action game. Go back. One view. See, I ordered them one one. Now, if I view this one, and I refresh, do 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 a few times, and go back. See, eight views, and now it's up front, right? I view this one. I refresh four views and now it's up front. So that's working. That's good. Uh, I'll have to style that a bit too. But I'll do most of that off camera and then talk to you guys about it. What did I do here, by the way? Do you see what's wrong here? <laughs> uh, the index.php. Oh, I remember I changed. That's whatever. I, I didn't save it, so there we go. So if we go there, go back, refresh this. Two views, four views, nine views. So that's good, it's working how it should be working. So now we'll order by the most viewed games, and that's uh, what we want. 
really quick, let's go into functions.php. We will see views here. Let's name this plays. Zero plays. Okay. We'll work on that a bit. But uh, there we go. So thank you for watching. Next time it's look a bit better. And we'll continue on with the comments, sidebar, whatever it may be at that time. In the future we'll make our own widget for something. I don't know. We'll just make up something. Popular games, widget, whatever. So stay tuned for that. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Awful Media. Follow me on Facebook if you want to see some stuff too. Uh, go to awfulmedia.com slash demos slash awful media version two and you can see what I'm working on right now with the website redesign this this is just stuff that's um this just in you know just it, it's a work in progress so nothing looks too great yet um but it's fully responsive working on some stuff uh yeah so check it out I will be updating it when I do something that matters on a local server I'll upload that so people can see it if they want to um, hmm, I want to talk about this a bit more in the future this it, this icon here is actually a font that I made using icomoon.io check that out so this is actually just text the logo is which is pretty cool all these are um, just they're just text as well so they scale so if I zoom in on them you can see that they don't get all pixely and stuff and the logo is a little bit rougher on the edges but <laughs> that's because it's a huge huge font but um, it looks pretty good when you zoom in on them right so maybe I'll show uh, a quick how to and how I did that but thank you for watching subscribe all that good stuff my name is Austin and I will see you next time